Good evening everyone, this is Bremster, and today I'm coming to you with a puzzle called Broken Thermo by Bellamus. Um, this puzzle looks really interesting, that's one very long thermo. So uh, I've looked at the rules and it'll be interesting to see how this one goes. Um, I've been sick a lot recently, so I'm really glad that I had recorded over a week in advance, because it's been about that long since I've recorded a puzzle. Um, and now I'm running out of... Uh, pre-recorded video, so I've got to get this one through. What's going on? I'm really not sure. I haven't been paying that much attention. So let's get straight to the puzzle. So normal Sudoku rules apply. In every box, in every row, and in every column, the digits one to nine get placed without repetition. Digits along a thermometer increase from the bulb to the tip. So as we go along thermos, digits must go up. However, a nine can be followed by a one on a thermo, but only if it crosses a region boundary. So for example, um, we could go uh, four, five, nine, one. That would be fine. So this could be a one in the middle of a thermo, but only if the previous cell, which is not in the same region, is a one. Very interesting. And I think it's going to be this thermo that tells us everything. So I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. Let's give this a shot. So my big question, I suppose, is where is one in box seven? because one has to go on the thermo somewhere and it has to be somewhere where it's preceded by a nine. So the thermo goes this way. So that is entering the box and that is entering the box. So one is in one of those two, which means in this box, a one is in one of those. That's not really helpful, is it? And the nine in this box has to be at the end of a thermo or leaving the box. So the nine is in one of those two. But if this is a nine, this is a one. If this is a nine, this is a one. So one of those two is a one. How do I use this? I've got to put a two in this box somewhere, but the two would have to go out after the one. So there's a two looking here, surely, because I couldn't put the two anywhere except after the one. And is the same true for the three? No, because I could go, no, this is not true. This is not true because I could put one here, two here. Or could I? Would that work? Because if I put a 2 here, the preceding cell would have to be a 1. Which could work if that's the 9 and that's the 1. Okay. Nine in this box is in one of those three. Because I could put, uh, yeah, I could put a 9 here if that's a 1. But if that was the case, that would have to be a one, and then one would be down here. But that also looks okay. Do I want to play with maximums? Maximum here is nine, maximum here is eight, maximum here, nine, eight, seven, six, five. But the maximum here again is nine. Thermo is going... Which cells enter the boxes? That one, 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 that one. Those are cells that are entering boxes. Actually, I might change those to blue because they're going to be the low. And leaving boxes... are those. Does that help me? So maximum here is nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. So this is one, two, three, two, three, four, three, four, five, four, five, six, five, six, seven, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, nine. If this isn't nine, this has to be nine, because if otherwise this is a, this thermo continues, and it'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine busted. This has to be a nine, which means this has to be a one. 
which means these can't, this, this can't be 9, 1. So those drop off being colored. This can't be a 1 anymore. So this can't be 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6. 1 is here. This can't be a 1. So this can't be a 9. Right. This can't be a 9. So this can't be a 1. Right. This colouring, I think, helped. Now, what... Mm -hmm. So, this is maximum 9, maximum 8, maximum 7, maximum 6. 1 is in one of... Pardon me, those two cells. Nine in this row is in one of those three. That helped. So the whole point is trying to figure out where I can't put. So this is quite a long thermo now. Maximum nine, maximum eight, maximum seven, maximum six, maximum five, maximum four, maximum three, maximum two. So one, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine. And if this didn't go 9, 1, this would be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, bust. So this is a 9 and this is a 1, which means this is not a 1, 9 here. Because this can't be a 1, so that, because it's going this way, this can't be a 9 and those are not coloured. So it's all about looking for where the long thermos are. And he, it, this must be a nine because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I'd, I'd run out. So this is nine and this is one. This is not one. Oh, this is fascinating. This is no longer nine, one. It's not possible. The nine is over here and must be here making that the one, which puts one in one of those two. This is fascinating. I've no idea if this was the intended way to solve the puzzle, but I'm really enjoying it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. This, this, this is too long for it to not reset. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One. It just doesn't work. So this has to be nine and one. Putting one up here and nine in here which has to be in one of those two, because I can't reset here. It's not here. This ends in a nine, which puts nine down here, which means this is nine and one. Oh, this is cool. And is that all of the resets on that thermo? I think it is, you know. I can't reset along here. I can't reset in here. Because I can't put 109 here. I can't put any more in here. 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 They're the resets on that thermo. That can't be a one. So I can't reset on that thermo. There's no more resets. That's it. The rest of this is normal. So this is maximum eight, seven, six, five, four, three. So two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight. Four, five pair makes this three and two. Eight is in one of those two. These are six, seven, and eight. Maximum eight, maximum seven, maximum six, maximum five, maximum four. But I have to put two in this box somewhere. The only place I could put it is there. Now I have to put three in the box somewhere. I can't put it on this thermo. This is the three. I have to put four in the box somewhere. That's the four. And this is five, six, or seven, which means this is a five, six, seven, triple. That's the eight. Now the two, three here, no. The four, however, makes that the three, which makes that the two. 
2 is now in here by Sudoku, and it has to be next to the 1. That's the 2. This is a triple. 5, 6, and 7. That's a 5, 6, 7 triple in the box. The 7 is in one of those two, taking the 7 out of there, but the 5, 6, 7 triple makes that the 4. 7 has to be in one of those two because of Sudoku. This is 5, 6, 7, or 8, and it can't be 5, 6, 7. That's, no, wait. Yeah, this is a 5, 6, 7 triple. This is the 8, which makes this 7, 6, 5, which makes this a 6, 7 pair, and makes this the 5. This is fascinating. How is this so smooth? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 3, 4, and 8 go into those. There's no 3 there. 7 looks up making that the 8. This is not the 8. 5 by Sudoku. 5 and 6. 5 is in one of those two. 6 is in one of those two. The 8 looks down making that the 4. So 4 comes out of those. This is a triple. Five, six, nine. Well, this can't be nine because I've got the nine on that thermo. So maximum eight, maximum seven. So this is six or seven and seven or eight. And the six, seven pair makes this the five and this the four. This becomes a six, seven pair, which can't be a six. This is the seven. This is the six. This is the seven. This is the eight. Holy cow. So this is a triple. One, two, three, four, five, six, three, four, and eight. And that can't be a three, sure. It can't even be a four. So this can't be a three, because three, in order for this to be a one, I'd have to put a nine in here and I can't do it. So this can't be three, two, one, zero. So it's not three, but even four, three, two, one doesn't work. So this is an eight and a nine, and there's no nine here. There's no eight here. The eight looks down, making that three and that eight. The three looks up making that four. This is now a pair. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is maximum seven. This is maximum five because it can't be six because if it was six, this would have no fill. It can't even be maximum five. This is maximum four, maximum three. So two, three, three, four, five, six, or seven. It's a two, three pair in this row. So this is now a triple. One, two, three, four, five, and seven. I'm wondering how much all of the classic Sudoku practice I've been doing recently has helped. The four takes four out of there. This is five or seven. There's no four there. That's a five, seven pair. That's a four. I say I've been doing this practice. That doesn't mean I haven't been missing stuff. It absolutely doesn't mean I haven't been missing stuff, such as that five looking up, taking five out of there. So this is a six, seven pair. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So these are two, three, four, and eight. There's no four there. So four is in one of those two by Sudoku. Oh, there's no four there either. That's a four, which doesn't seem to have helped that much. I think I'm not understanding this thermo well enough. I mean, I've been trying to improve my classic Sudoku, but that doesn't mean I'm... I'm not saying I'm better at classic Sudoku, and that's it, I'm all better now. Not at all. This is a 9. 8, 8, 8 is in one of those two, and it's not in the corner. So that's the 8, which takes 8 out of here. I've now got a 2, 3 pair. That, you know, I had that two, three pair before. Need to put a six in here. These two, three, four, six, eight. Well, eight is in one of those two by Sudoku. One is right there by Sudoku because of the ones looking up and that one. That's a one, which puts one over here in the corner. Two, 
Now, this still doesn't feel very restricted. Maximum seven, minimum two, uh, minimum three. So three, four, five, six, four, five, six, seven doesn't seem, not four, four, five, six, seven doesn't seem to do much, does it? All it said is there's no two, three there. I'm not seeing it. Three is in one of the, well, three, where's three in this row? Yeah, where's three in this row? And this is the sort of trick I've been looking for as I get better at while I'm trying to improve my classic Sudoku. Can't put three in any of those because it's three looking up. Three isn't in any of those. That's a four. Three is in one of those two. That three looks up. This is a three. So there's a two, a five, a six, and a seven. There's no two there. So two is in one of those two. So this is five, six, seven, and it's not seven. This is a five, six pair. So this is a two. Not sure how to resolve that five, six. There's no five here. Five is in one of those two. This is six, seven, or eight. Definitely missing a trick. That four has been looking at that for ages. Five, six, seven. Which means there's no seven or eight there. That's the six which takes six out of there and six out of there. That has been there for a very long time. Four is in one of those two now. Five? Well, that with the six, seven makes that the five. Five is now on this thermo. That five makes that the seven, which makes that the eight. So I know what this is. One, two, three, four, five. That's a six, taking six off this thermo. The six looks back, making that the seven, which looks down, making that the six and that the seven. The seven looks back saying that's not the seven. So this can't be the five. There's nothing higher than it available. This is the three. This could be either four or five, but the three makes that the two and that the three. The two looks across saying that's not the two, that's the two. I said I was getting better. I didn't say I was good yet. The five looks up making that the four and that the five. This is the seven to complete the box. The four looks down making that the three, which makes that the two, which looks across making that the three and that the two. This is the four to complete the box. Now the seven makes that the five, which makes that the six. I can take six out of here. This is a seven, eight pair. And I use that seven to make that the eight and that the seven. This box is missing a six. This box is missing one, two, a five, which makes this the six and this the five. And that is the solution to the puzzle. Absolutely, I liked that puzzle. Figuring out how these thermos had to work, that was amazing fun. I'm glad I started colouring where the transitions could possibly happen and then figured out, hang on, I had to do a transition here or this would be too long. And that transition allowed me to knock out these transitions and then continuing with that. I think that was the right way to do it. And I'm really glad I found that. If I hadn't found that and there was a chance I wouldn't, I think this puzzle would have taken me a lot longer. That was great fun. Thank you, Bellamus. That was gr that was really, really good. Um, and hopefully the practice I've been doing of classic while I was sick has made this puzzle, the, the flow of the classic that I've been doing a little bit better. We will find out. Thanks everyone for watching. And as always, good luck with your solving.